I want to show you how you can use purchase requisitions with Dynamics GP in the GP workflow to help approve and control purchases within your organization. So I'm logged in here as a requisitioner and I'm going to hit enter purchase requisition. I'm just going to enter some information for something I wish to purchase. I've done my homework so I know exactly what I want. I know what I want to purchase, what the price is and from whom I'm going to buy it. So I put that requisition together here and I'm going to submit it for approval. I can add a little note if I want to. As an approver, I can be notified a number of different ways that I've got an action to take on a new requisition. I might look at my home screen here and see all information about requisitions that need approval. I can also open up this list of requisitions and I can see here that I've got one that's submitted and needs approval. I can drill down on that to get additional information and I could approve it right here if I wanted to. Also, I've been set up to get emails about tasks that I need to complete. Here's an approval task that I need to complete. I can either approve that or reject it right here. I could drill down from this email into Dynamics GP and take a look at that requisition right there. But in this case, I know enough about the requisition to know that it needs to be approved. So I'm just going to hit approve here right from my email. And I can add a comment if I want to. And then that requisition becomes approved, and now it's ready to turn into a purchase order. And if I want to, I can set it up so I get notified at every step of the way. For example, this email shows me that this requisition has been finally approved and is ready for purchase. So the combination of the purchase requisition functionality with NGP plus the new workflow functionality allows you to better control your purchases within your organization.